Next one up, which I think probably people are going to go bananas over, is the uh, the 70 Dodge Power Wagon. And that is a really cool looking truck, man. I tell you what. Welcome to another episode of Hot Wheels TV. Today, we got the K-Case Zamet cars. Uh, the latest ones from Walmart. And some uh, color swing variations. And uh, let's get right to it. Now, uh, the Zamet cars, the 92 Ford Mustang. Now, it's uh, done up in the same kind of odd design that the, uh, that the mainline car had, you know. The tan one and the orange one and all the odd looking colors all over it. And here it is with uh, olive and black. And uh, looks like some, some like light gray on there also. But I was able to go through the bin. Now, um, at our Walmart, I don't know about your Walmart, but at our Walmart, they put out these wedge kind of um, displays, you know, like they normally have at uh, Family Dollar or um, uh, Big Lots, you know, stuff like that. They're up on the shelf. So these uh, I did not find in on the pegs. So if you're walking around and you don't see anything on the pegs, walk over to the next aisle because that's where I found these. They were in the other aisle and they were in a wedge and they're just sitting on the shelf. There were two wedges and they also had some of the, uh, some of the uh, car culture cars also, which we're going to get to later on. So, uh, but yeah, I got a chance to go through all of them that were there. Uh, of course, I left a bazillion of them, but there are um, kind of uh, kind of different color swings on the olive for these cars also. And you see that I do have three. Uh, I, I grabbed one set for me and one set for our buddy uh, Brent, who always gets stuff for us. So he brings me stuff. I give him stuff. Cool, right? All right. So, um, the colors on, on the front are either a light or a dark uh, olive. And also on the, on the rear quarter panel, you can see that there is a very dark olive. And uh, this other one here is a lighter olive. And anything up on the hood? Yeah, yeah. There's, there's a dark olive and a light olive on the hood too. So if you do have a chance to look through there and you're into the, uh, the color swings, See what you can find on uh, on the Mustang. All right. Next one up is the Custom 71 L Camino, and uh, that is done with uh, dark red, black, and a light gray flame setup. Uh, has red windows on it. The base is chrome, and uh, the back where the rocket engines are are uh, black plastic, and uh, the parts in between are red to go along with the uh, the red transparent windows which are very very dark and the interior on this is black which goes with the uh, the rocket engines the wheels on this are uh, blacked out mc5s with a red chrome ring around them uh, big ones in the back and little ones in front now sometimes the uh, the grill on these are uh, uh, some are kind of smoother than the others some are you know hatch marked but all the ones that i looked through we're, uh, we're all the same. So, but if you find something different on the grills, you know, let us know. All right. Next one up, which I think probably people are going to go bananas over, is the uh, the 70 Dodge Power Wagon. And that is a really cool looking truck, man. I tell you what. It uh, has white down the sides with some black stripes. Got marker lights done up. Um, the black Hot Wheel logo right behind the front wheel. Uh, and window is a light yellow transparent now all the ones that i looked at uh all the all the yellows were the same so you know keep an eye out for that the interior is black along with the uh the bed liner in the back uh the base is black plastic which goes with the front grill and bumper the wheels are um yellow bead locks great big ones all the way around and uh that is a really nice looking truck so those are the Zamac cars, all three of them for the K case. And that is the 92 Ford Mustang, the K 
Custom 71 El Camino, and the 70 Dodge Power Wagon. All right, that's for the K case. Now, next thing up, uh, and these were in those shippers also, in those, in those wedges. This is the uh, 64 Nova Wagon Gasser from the Southern Gassers, right? Uh, Steve Smith and those guys. Uh, now, if you look here on the side, the Gassers emblem on the door is yellow on the bottom one. And the top one, it is orange. Now, for some reason, the yellow one looks bigger than the orange one. I don't know why. Maybe it's because of the color. But as you can see, uh, maybe, you know, my eyes are tricking me, but the yellow one looks bigger. I haven't got my uh, my vernier calipers out and measured it yet, but uh, it does look bigger. I don't know why. But the stripes also on the, uh, from the nose to the tail are also the same colors. So the, uh, the yellow one uh, on the door has yellow stripes all the way down, and the orange one has orange stripe all the way down, all right? And uh, there were a few of them in that shipper uh, at our Walmart. So keep your eyes open for that one. Another one is the uh, Treasure Hunt Custom 56 Ford truck. And no, you're going to say, oh, yeah, you took all those treasure hunts. No, I didn't. Uh, I left them. Uh, except that I took these two because if you look at this one, the door... On the bottom one is orange, and the door on the top one is red, all right? Now, normally when I see a whole bunch of treasure hunts, I will pick them all out of that bin, and I will hang them up on the hanger, and anybody, next guy that walks in is going to see all them treasure hunts right there, and I'm not going to be the guy that takes them all, okay? I left them for everybody else. But these guys here, definitely cool. Um... The green on the hood also is different on these. The one with the orange on the door has a darker green on the hood. And the one with the red door has a light green on the hood. And the roof on the one with the orange door is lighter. And the, uh, the one with the dark door is much darker on the, on the roof also. So uh, there you go. These are... Definitely some big time color swings on the custom 56 Ford truck K case treasure hunt. All right. Next one up is the Big Air Bel Air 56 Chevrolet. Now you can see on the side the uh, the tampos and the markings. Uh, the top one here is a very very dark red, even a maroon. And the bottom one is a very bright red. And that's not a maroon. That's a bright red. Uh, the colors on the hood are pretty much the same, though. They are a, a light red uh, on both of them. But you can definitely see the colors on the side. Totally, totally different colors. A maroon and a, uh, a bright red. All right? Cool. Now, this one here. I know you guys have been seeing it on the internet a little bit. Uh, what we have here is the Porsche 911 GT3 RS, all right? Now, this one here comes in uh, flat black. And if you look at the tampos on the side of this one, they are very dark yellow, maybe even a gold, all right? And you can see, I will put it up next to this other one. And the bottom one, you can see, is much, much lighter, all right? Now, if you look on the hood, huge difference. The top one, which is the darker yellow or the gold, has much, much more gold on, or much more color on the hood, where the bottom one, the light color, you can hardly see at all. Now, most of them that I found in those bins were the light colored ones all right now both of these are flat black all right flat black now i found one actually i found probably three or four in that bin it is semi-gloss it's got a pretty good shine to it it's not not a gloss black enamel but it is a semi-gloss got a real good shine to it you can see big difference in the shine all right now this one is done in the light colors, it's the light yellow, 
And I didn't find any dark yellow or the or gold, whatever that we're gonna end up calling it, in the uh, in the shiny black or the semi-gloss black. All right. So check out those shippers at Walmart. Like I said, if you don't see them in the hot, normal Hot Wheel aisle or hanging on the pegs, go around the corner and uh, they had them sitting in there, just in the in the on the shelves, two of them, uh, and there they were. So uh, see what you can find. All right. I didn't say I didn't find a super either because I, I never find a super, you know, somebody got it. I don't know, but that's it. So uh, these are our K case variations from the, uh, the, the latest Walmart, you know, wedge displays. Uh, let us know what you find or if you have already found some uh, some stuff that I didn't find in those, uh, put it in the comments below, you know, and uh, that's what we do. I appreciate it. And of course, appreciate you guys stopping by and uh, watching Hot Wheels TV. Please share our videos. Please tell your friends. Please be kind to one another. And uh, please subscribe too. So until the next time we see you right here at Hot Wheels TV. Hey, hopefully we'll see you out there somewhere looking for Hot Wheels real soon. Take care. Bye-bye.